Hey guys and welcome to this video about PowerBot. I'm pretty much going to go over the basics of where you find this bot and how to run it. Uh, all the appropriate links will be in the description but as you can see here you go to PowerBot.org pretty much click on the RSBot link and uh, download it. You're going to need Java to run it but uh, as I said all the links will be in the description to uh, tutorials, you know the download link itself etc. Uh, so right here I'm just showing you some of the features on the uh, menus and uh, here is, is how you run an account. Uh, you, you make an account on this screen and uh, you put in your password and uh, select obviously if you're a member and stuff. You can also choose the reward for random events. This uh, solves random events on its own. Pretty cool and you can also select to take breaks if you uh, if you feel the need to. Uh, but right here I'm going to show you a demonstration of a mining script and uh, this mining script got to say is pretty awesome. There's thousands of different scripts for uh, each individual skill in RuneScape uh, on the forum. And PowerBot actually comes with a ton of different scripts to begin with for multiple skills and objectives. And you're going to see here that I run Perfect Miner. So I'm going to run it at Varrock East. And uh, I'm actually not going to choose to bank it and you'll see why. Uh, I choose Copper simply just because I want it to uh, go as fast as possible. Uh, just to show you as an example. And yeah, I'm going to Power Mine. Uh, which basically means for those of you who don't know, uh, I'm gonna, just going to mine away. And then straight away when I, when I get a full inventory, I'm just going to drop them all. And then continue mining. Obviously that has its benefits and negatives. Obviously if your sole goal is just to level up really fast then power mining would in this situation be faster. But uh, if you wanted to get money for all your items instead of dropping them then obviously you can bank as well. I'm going to show you both banking and power mining uh, just to you know give you a flavor of what both are and uh, how fast they go and stuff. But uh, you're going to see the timer is actually goes up to about 1 minute and 40 something. And uh, I've got this actually sped up just so you don't actually need to see me mining and then dropping dropping a ton, ton of ore, but actually mined a full inventory in less than two minutes. And uh, bear in mind there's only two uh, copper rocks there, so obviously if I was mining in a place uh, that had a ton more, then uh, it would go even faster. But uh, just showing you copper as an example, and uh, right here I start to run it to bank instead, and you're going to see it mine a full inventory, go to the bank, come back, and uh, that's that's all it really does. It's it's as simple as that. It's gonna it's gonna do exactly what you do, but you don't have to uh, you don't have to do it yourself. And uh, also for those wondering, you do not actually have to have it on the screen. You can do anything else. You know uh, what you'd normally do, and uh, you can actually select an option so it uses even less CPU and RAM than it normally would. Uh, it's, at its current rate, it doesn't really use m that much at all anyway. Just as much as. Uh, playing RuneScape would regularly uh, pretty much so really you could have it running 24 7 or for however long you're actually on your PC and it'll run fine and the great thing is as you saw earlier in the beginning of the video when I ran the script it automatically logs in so if it gets into uh, any trouble and actually logs out or for whatever reason uh, you know you go offline and come back online it'll actually re-log you in uh, whenever it can and uh, it's as simple as that. That's one of the awesome features about it. It'll also solve all the random events you go into. Uh, so if you if you were uh, if you were worried about it getting stuck, that's not going to happen. It's got that for you. And uh, yeah, as I said, you could leave it on for however long you want. And right here, it goes to bank. It automatically knows where the bank is. It'll go there. It'll bank, and it'll come back. That's the same for any script that PowerBot has on the forums. And as I said earlier. There are a ton of scripts, there's a ton of tutorials if you actually ever need help and uh, if there's a specific problem that you have there's going to be a, uh, a forum where you can ask questions and uh, but yeah in the tutorial section there's actually probably going to be a Q&A for that itself and uh, right here it's going back to the mine, does it simple, does it fast, is it efficient and uh, if there's actually a, a strange path because obviously at Varrock East and uh, there's only one, one true route to the to the bank. The, there's an obvious route, but uh, if you're say somewhere in the middle of the woods and you're mining, uh, you're uh, mining or woodcutting or whatever there, and uh, then for whatever reason you wanted to uh, return, uh, then you'd uh, you do you do that and it'd come back and uh, it'll do whatever you want it to do. And right here, a new tab is opened, and it's pretty much why I'm doing this is I'm going to show you that you can actually run as many as you want. Well. As many as your computer can take, because obviously there's a limit. I'd say almost any computer will be able to run at least two to three tabs, which is obviously an awesome feature in itself, because that means you could have like a woodcutting account on one, a mining account on another, uh, one that maybe does combat, not even, you know, skilling in itself. Uh, so yeah, I'm not actually going to run a script on this tab. I'm just going to show you that it logs into an another account fine. And uh, this one's actually a fishing account. And you notice there, that's a lot of feathers. And uh, I probably stopped that before I was making this video uh, on its way back to uh, on its way back to the bank, obviously. And right here is the site itself. 
and the tutorial section if you want to go there and check that out. If you want to do anything on the site, obviously just visit the link in the description. Be sure to check the bot out. It is awesome. You won't regret it. And that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and see you.